Hey guys, welcome back to the Attic CTC. Um, I'm going to be opening another booster box of the team up because I, I think I did a pretty okay job last time. So I decided to open another booster box for you guys to see. And as well, I'll give out all 36 code cards for you guys as well. So um, stay tuned with the channel. Um, click on the notification button if you want to get this early as always. Be the first one to grab them. Um, subscribe so you know whenever I post up stuff as well. And no further to go. So you guys know what this is. This is Team Up. Um, the new Pokemon set that came out last week. Um, very nice booster box. I love this set because of the Team Up characters. Which is awesome because they combine two Pokemon together. For a GX. So that is awesome on there. And hopefully, I'll find something, some good pulls in this one. So, let's get started. So, put that open. All right. So, let's start ripping it out and see. Hopefully, I can do some decent or good pulls again this time. Um, so far, I like this set. So, this has been a good set for me. And let's see how this one does. So, I'll put that down there. Put another one down here. So there you go, guys. 36 packs ready to go. And this is just an empty box. So I'm just going to throw it to the side. So, all right, out of the way. So we'll put this over here. And then I'll just put down like all the decent cards that I'll be pulling out. Um, but this is what it looks You guys seen videos like this before. So I'm just going to go through everything quick. Oh, it's not that quick. Uh, reverse. <laughs> Trainer, so I'll put it up there and these are just the regular rares and then the regular trainers and then here's the first code card for you guys Enjoy And I'll just throw the comments out on the side so you guys don't see it So I'm just gonna put the rares and the reverse hollows out and about that's a pretty cool squirtle nice artwork reverse so I put there rares Trainers and here's another code card for you guys Guys, hopefully you guys are enjoying all the code cards. I'm giving out for free um, Supporting this supporting me will help out a lot. I don't get any pay money paid for this stuff I'm doing. I'm just doing it fun for you guys. So there's no money involved in posting these videos or anything. So just please um, Support the channel. They'll be awesome makes me feel like you know guys are watching me so i keep on opening more stuff but um it's climbing so which i like you know it shows that people are into it so if it doesn't climb then that's when i kind of feel like i shouldn't even post up videos anymore because you know there's no one wants to watch them so glad you guys like my video that's why you keep watching it. that's good um then i'll give you more of the code card and everything as well so there's that one. <clears throat> so here's the next one. Hopefully you guys uh, already bought some of these stuff already and get your cards ready. Um, but that's a reverse trainer and there's Erica Hospitality right there. That's a really good trainer card actually. Very hard card to pull. Um, I opened cases of these boxes already and it's like almost one in every two box kind of or something like that. Maybe my luck is bad, worse than other people's luck, but I opened, I think, four cases of these already, and that's my odds. It's like one every two box I get at Erica's Hospitality. Oh, there's my first Toppy Coco. That's awesome. That's the, um, that's the Prism Star that comes in this set. Here's Ampharis GX. Back to back, Coco and Ampharis. Um... The Prism Star is not too bad in this set um, because it's harder to pull now, so it, it makes the card even better. Not like before where you get just a crap load of Prism Stars in every box, so the card is basically worthless. Now they make it a little bit better. Um, they're still kind of almost worthless, but they have some value in this set so far right now. So <clears throat> hopefully it keeps its value because it's, uh, it's actually a little bit harder to pull than normal. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> but all in all, it's not, they're not too bad in this set for value wise. So before you pull them, they're just a useless 50 cents a quarter card and only one that's a dollar or something. But now there's some that are pretty decent. 
So, so far, out of all the packs I opened, I pull one GX and then also a, a, a hollow Erica. And the rest of them are just non hollow, which is crap. And so I'm on a bad streak right now. Hopefully it turns around and does better, but so far I'm on a bad streak right now. See another crappy um, non hollow rare. Yeah. So hopefully it turns around at this part because I'm almost down to a little bit past half of the one side and not much pools yet. So here's the Shaman Prism Star. Nice card. Here's my first hollow rare. I like the Lugia. It's awesome artwork. First actual hollow rare. Wow. So I'm starting off really bad in this one. Well, hopefully it turns around on the second half of this boss because the first half has been just crap. So, uh, not yet. So, that's a dud pack. Oops, sorry guys. Alright, so. Two thirds down from the one side stash. One of memory. Reverse and non-hollow rare again. Oh, let's see. Yeah, I haven't used the background playmat for a while, so I, I I was figuring you guys missed those that background playmat, so I brought it back up again. The Pikachu team, um, the what was that? The team score or something outfit that he's wearing, which is pretty cool. I like that. That's um, some older stuff now. You know, it was more recent back then, but now it gets older and older. It's harder to get, so it's a really nice playmat. I actually laminated it so it doesn't get damaged as it doesn't get damaged as quick as not getting laminated. Wow, I'm doing really bad because so far what I pulled one hollow rare. That is crap. And I have like what like three packs left on this side, four packs left, and one hollow rare. Wow. I should just stop on my first box I open and don't even open anymore, huh? On video. And another non hollow rare. Wow. This looks like it's going to be a dud set or something, dud box, but I still have hopes. I still have hopes, guys. Wow, look at that. My second hollow rare of the box. And only one GX so far. Yeah, that is crazy so far. Two more packs on the right, the right side of the box, and then we'll go to the left. So hopefully the left side will bring back everything. But so far the right side's just been crap. Mister Mime and another GX, but another crappy GX. These aren't worth that much. So so far I'm losing my ass off on the box right now. Value wise. The two GX I pulled was what, like $4 each, $3 each. And then the two Prism Star, what, a two or $3 Prism Star. So out of a, what, an, an $80, $100 booster box, I pulled what, like $10 value wise? Woohoo! I love to throw away my money. That's how it feels when you open these booster box. All right, so hopefully the second side of the box brings me better luck because those pulls is just crap no value wise but that's crazy this is actually my first box that i'm pulling three prism stars wow the odd is normally two but i don't know i guess it is this box because i'm pulling three prism stars it's gonna be a crap box because the rest is just crap just like, you know, back all the other sets that have a bunch of Prism Stars, you get, like, really bad pulls out of those. So, hopefully, this is not the case. But here's my third Hollow Rare from the box. Third Hollow Rare. Wow. Such bad luck right there, huh? So, basically, you know, green cards. <laughs> if you guys know what I'm talking about for the cold card. Whenever you see those, you know that they're just a junkie pack. Like that. See? Junk pack. Meaning this, nothing's good, see? Just a reverse of that, and then a non-hollow rare. 
and nothing. Uh, that's the only thing I don't like about how Pokemon set these up. Uh, you open it up, all, really, all you care for is the code card in the back. If it's white, that means it's reverse, a hollow rare, or something good. See, hollow rare. Um, which not does not always mean something good. Because like that hollow rare, it's not even worth the, anything at all. What, a quarter maybe? So, so, so far I'm losing my ass off. So, here's Votorb. And, huh, a regular GX again. Where is my tag team? Full art regular GX. Not even worth that much. On a crappy, not worth GX card. <laughs> So that card is worth what, like six dollars? So I'm at sixteen, seventeen dollars maybe out of a eighty, hundred dollar booster box. I am so damn happy. <laughs> oh my gosh, another crappy GX. Wow. Where is my full my my full art trainer or a tag team? Wow, this is called tag team up. And I had I haven't put one tag team card. What a crappy box. Reverse all golem and Mr. My Rare. I'll throw this on this side. And just those. So it feels like gambling at a casino, you do better luck maybe on like a poker table or a blackjack table but this one is basically you get the worst luck wow bill's analysis giving you info on this one i opened four cases which is what 24 booster box guess how many of these i pull i pulled i think three or four of them out of four cases so basically i pulled one of these per case i don't know if that's my luck that i'm getting such a bad crappy luck on it and then other people maybe pull more, but one per case pretty much is how I get this steward build analysis. Oh my gosh. So, yeah, build analysis is actually one of the hardest cards to pull for a regular rare trainer. <clears throat> so, it's not a super high value card that would bring me all my money back, but, you know, it's a very hard card to pull. All right, so I'm halfway through with the second pile. Still nothing great to be happy for. And another non-hollow rare, like always. My luck of the day there. Come on, give me a team up card. Or a full art or something, you know. But nothing. Come on, give me a team of. How about my alternative artwork full art card or something? All right. So, oh my gosh, why is this stupid Empress keeps coming with me? Oh my gosh, and the Empress too. Look, I got double on the Cobalion and now double on the Empress. It's a nice card. Don't get me wrong. You know, it's a rainbow rare. Which is a very nice, beautiful card, as you can see. But it's like one of the cheapest Rainbow Rare from the set. That doesn't pay for my box. Come on. This is crazy here. Let me see. I have what, like seven packs left. Hopefully, I have another hit. But it looks like I pull a lot. I did a lot of hits in this box. It looks like you know, like because normal odds is what four or five per box. I did pretty decent on this. I got what one, two. No, I got five. Maybe there is one more for me. Come on, turn it around. Give me luck, Nido King. And then that nothing great. Co card. Oh. All right, come on. Give me a full art or something trainer. Give me a full art. I want a full art trainer. Those are actually hard to pull. 
not worth a lot, but they're actually hard to pull. All right, three packs left. What can it be? Can it come down to it being great? Sabrina's suggestion. Ooh, I put Evelyn. Awesome. Look, check that out. I asked for a full art chain and I got it. Nice. Evelyn, guys. That's awesome. Look at that. Such a beautiful card. I love these new trainer cards right now with a nice color background. Those backgrounds are there, like an orange one with the one the hat background type. You know, different color hat, different color background. That's awesome. Evelyn. Nice. All right, coming back with a little bit. Not too bad. <clears throat> Better than some boxes that I've opened before, you know, but um, doesn't cover the cost of the box. But it's better than nothing because I did pull quite a few cards. Here's my hollow rare, Absol. So not too bad, guys. Not too bad. I'm okay with it. You know, uh, you can't complain. Life is a journey, so, you know. Last pack of the day right here, and it's a Blastoid. I don't know why. Blastoid and Charizard is actually really hard to pull. and They're just regular rares. That's crazy, huh? So, thank you very much for watching my channel, guys. And hopefully you subscribe and click the notification button so you can pick up these code cards. Here's the last one for the day. Enjoy the rest of the weekend. Thank you again. And hopefully I'll just open in more stuff. Um, if there's no... If there's more release, I'll open more stuff. If not, I'll open another booster box for you guys. But it'll be probably next week. Thank you again. Enjoy the weekend. Bye-bye.